Hello, in this video I will show you how to set up your own charge station node. Only on Omega 2 Plus will be used as hardware in this video, but most OpenWRT LED devices will work. First of all, you should set up internet connection on your Onion Omega. The described manual can be found on Box Onion IO website. It is really very easy. Next, you should connect to SSH console of your device. For Mac and Linux users, it can be done with SSH command for, for Windows. You can use POTI for example. Before running the setup script, you should first check if there is internet connection on your device. Ping Google for example. Next we will run setup script. I just copy and paste it. The script will update and download some packages and download some scripts for our node. As soon as it is done, you can move to the next step. Next we will repair our SD card. So you should insert your SD card into your on your Omega 2. But be really careful, all data on your SD card will be destroyed. So that is quite a responsible job. Well, insert your SD card and check if it is here. Here we can see our SD card. So that is our device and two partitions of it. We will remove all existing partitions and create new ones. Let's use F disk. So let's remove all existing first. Press D. Press D once more because we have two partitions. Now you can check that no partition exists now. Let's create new one. By default first. All by default, so press enter. Next you should enter how much size will be first partition. For our solution we will use is first partition swap. So uh, I will give half of cables, for example. You see it. Next, create, next create second our working partition. All by default. We will use all remaining space. And finally we will press W for saving our partitions. Well done. So next step we should prepare our partitions. First for swap and second for working processes okay so let's make swap partition done and finally let's format second partition Oof. EXT for file system.
We should wait until it will be formatted. As soon as it will be done, we will set up some settings like our not station address and like switch port done okay next Let's support our node address. We will use UC coins. So that is our switch I will port. By default it is 11 but you can change it on your own. So next you just should commit all the changes. And you can reboot. That's it. The node after restarting will download GET and it will prepare all required settings. And as soon as it synchronizes other network, you you will be able to use it.